is never use any chemical treatment on eyelashes or eyebrows. Okay, scabies, one of the most commonly discussed diseases and one of the most common contagious diseases, scabies. It's easily spread skin disease caused by a very small species of mite. Eight-legged mite cause scabies in humans is microscopic. The female mite burrows just beneath your skin and produces a tunnel in which it deposits eggs. Eggs mature in 21 days and the new mites work their way to the surface of your skin where they mature and can spread to other areas of your skin or to the skin of other people. Close physical contact and less often sharing clothing or bedding with an infected person can spread the mites. Dogs, cats and humans all are affected by their own distinct species of mite. Each species of mite prefers one specific type of host and doesn't live long away from that preferred host. Symptoms of scabies. Mites that cause scabies burrow into the skin and deposit their eggs forming a burrow that looks like a pencil mark. Eggs mature in 21 days. Itching, rashes, sores on the skin from scratching and digging. Thin pencil mark lines on the skin. Mites may be more widespread or a baby's skin, causing pimples over the trunk or small blisters over the palms or the soles. In young children, the head, neck, shoulders, palms and soles are involved. In older children and adults, the hands, wrists, genitals and abdomen are involved. What are the complications of scabies? A more severe form of scabies called crusted scabies may affect certain high-risk groups which include people with chronic health conditions or HIV patients, people who are very ill such as patients in hospital or nursing facilities. Crusted scabies tend to be crusty and scaly and cause large areas of the body. It's very contagious and can be hard to treat. Diagnosis of scabies can be by microscopic examination by the presence of mites on their eggs. Treatment is by permethrin 5% twice with a week or so between each application. Permethrin is generally considered safe for children and adults. Lindane is usually applied in two treatments spaced about a week apart. This medication isn't safe for children younger than two years, women who are pregnant or nursing or people with weakened immune systems. Gortamiton, mechanic non-chemical medication is applied once a day for two to five days. All of these medications kill the mites promptly. You may find that itching doesn't stop entirely for several weeks. Contact precautions with protective garments, example gowns, when providing care to any patient with crusted scabies until successfully treated. Wash hands thoroughly after providing care to any patient. Isolate patients with crusted scabies from other patients who do not have crusted scabies and consider assigning a cohort of caretakers to care only for patients with crusted scabies. Maintain contact precautions until skin scrapings from a patient with crusted scabies are negative. Patients with crusted scabies generally must be treated at least twice a week apart. Oral ivermectin may be necessary for successful treatment. Limit the visitors for patients with crusted scabies. Visitors should use the same contact precautions and protective clothing as a staff. Home treatment, cool and soak your skin. Soaking in cool water or applying a cool wet washcloth to irritated areas of your skin may minimize itching. Apply soothing lotion. Calamine lotion available without a prescription can effectively, effectively relieve the pain and itching of minor skin irritations. Take antihistamine. At your doctor's suggestion, you may find that over-the-counter antihistamines relieve the allergic symptoms caused by scabies. Prevention. Clean all clothes and linen. Use hot soapy water to wash all clothing. Towels and bedding use at least three days before treatment. Dry with high heat. Starve the mites. Consider placing items you can't wash in a sealed plastic bag and leave it in an out of the way place such as in your garage for a couple of weeks. Mites die if they don't eat for a week.